what force is required to punch a 20 millimeter diameter hole in a plate that is 25 millimeters thick the shear stress e the shear strength is okay given given diameter is 20 millimeter thickness i nothing t is equal to 25 millimeters shear strength which is tau is 350 mega newton per meter squared so ang required required is uh, force solution so we all know ang um, shear is equal to force over area we're looking for force we given ito area what is area so ang um, area is in, since this is shear strength the area is uh, Ito yung pinunch na hole. So, the area is this part. Yung parang ding ding. So, area is equal to imagine top view yan. So, the diameter so diameter uh, i mean circumference ng hole circumference of the hole times the thickness so pi d the circumference is pi d or 2 pi r times thickness so pi times 20 millimeters na 0 0.02 meters times thickness not 0 0.25 0 0.025 meters is equal to oh, someone else. 1 1 1.57 times 10 raised to negative 3 meters squared store shot sa A store A now force is equal to tau 350 mega newton per meter squared times area a meter squared f is equal to a times 350 0 0.549778 mega newtons or um 549.778 kilo newtons Determine the average shear stress in the 20 millimeter diameter pin at A and the 30 millimeter diameter pin at B that support the beam in figure 1.29. Okay, so given given we have an applied force of 30 third um F is equal to 30 kilonewtons. Okay. Diameter A is equal to 20 millimeter is equal to 0 0.02 meters. Diameter B is equal to 30 millimeter is equal to 0 0.03 meter. Required. 
required um, shear stress at A and shear stress at B solution. Let's uh, draw first the FBD. So here we have an applied force. We have force here. A reaction at B and a reaction at A. Two reactions at A, assuming. So AX, AY, and B, F, B. Okay. And then A is a double shear, double shear, and B is single shear. So, ahanapin muna itong forces A, X, A, Y, and F, B. Summation of all forces. Oh, no. Ito muna. So, first, um, 30 kilonewtons. 4 If we move, will moment at A M A is equal to 0 is equal to Uh, 30 kilonewtons 2 meters tapos ito so minus FBY times 6 meters 0 is equal to 60 kilonewton meters minus FBY is 4 FBY is 4 fifths FB hmm, 4 fifths FB times 6 meters therefore FB is equal to 60 kilonewton meter all over 4 fifths times 6 meters F B is equal to 12.5 kilonewtons. With this summation of all forces at x is equal to um, FBX minus AX. FBX is 3 fifths FB minus AX. A equal to 0. AX is equal to 3 fifths FB is equal to 3 fifths. 12.5 AX is equal to 7.5 kilo newtons summation of all forces at y is equal to 0, summation of all forces at y is equal to FB y plus AY minus 30 kilonewtons. So AY is equal to 30 kilonewtons 
minus FBY is 4 fifth FB. So AY is equal to 30 kilonewtons minus 4 fifths of 12.5. AY is equal to 30 minus 4 fifths of 12.5 equal to 20 kilo newton next so so now we have the forces fb is 12.5 so pwede nang gagamitin yan sa formula at A, FA is equal to the resultant of AX and AY. So, AX 7.5 kilonewtons squared plus 20 kilonewtons squared. So, FA is equal to 21.36 Zero, zero something kilo newton stores stores sa a stores sa a v okay so for a tau a is e is equal to v a over area A. VA is uh, FA. So, since A is A, uh, since A is double shear, FA over 2, since double shear, over area, which is 0 0.02, ang diameter, Pi over 4, 0 0.02 meters squared equal to A key. Okay. A, A kilonewton over 2 over pi over 4, 0 0.02 meters squared is equal to lang pala um, 0 0.02 meters is equal to 33,995.51075 kilonewton per meter squared or um, pwede rin 33.995 mega newton per meter squared or mega pascal Okay, so for B, for B, tau B is equal to VB over AB is equal to for FB. Since um, B is single shear, no need to divide by 2 FB over pi over 4. Diameter is 30 millimeters, 0 0.03 meters squared is equal to F na same ko ba? FB, 12.5 pala. 12.5 over pi over 4 times 0 0.03 squared. 17,683.88257 kilonewtons kilonewtons per meter squared or kilopascal or 17.684 megapascal uh, okay 17.684 